He was arraigned on the new charges today. It's the same case. It's just they've changed what they've charged him with. It's the same facts. As you heard the judge say, the same bond, same evidence, and we expect the same result. Uh, R. Kelly has complied with every single condition of bond. He's been perfect while he's out. He, he reports a pretrial like he's supposed to. Uh, he comes to court like he's supposed to, and there's no reason. Bond is to ensure that somebody appears in a court proceeding and, and for the safety of the public. He's not a danger to the public, and he appears in court. I, I think he's feeling positive. Um, it's tough. Every, everything is against him. I mean, imagine being in that position. It, it's contrary to every belief I have and we should all have. You're, you're supposed to be presumed innocent. He should be able to make a living. He shouldn't have to deal with, with rumor and innuendo all the time. People should wait and let a case get decided in the courtroom. You know, one of the things that I find particularly offensive is there was an award show this weekend and the so-called victims are hooping and hollering. Uh, they're there with their parents. They're celebrating and they're posting stuff on Facebook. This is a bunch of people who are going all over the country getting wine and dine like they're some kind of heroes. They're not heroes. They're not heroes at all. And they're loving every minute of it. I I've never seen supposed victims behave like this. And the reason why they're behaving like this is they aren't victims. Mr. Kelly is uh, upbeat. Initially, he was a little depressed, but I mean, with anything, uh, someone accuses you of something, you'll be depressed. But he knows the truth, and we do. Great attorneys on board, a great team, um, and that's what we are.